people new to streaming might wonder. How are people able to stream for so long? I get tired after just a few hours. I've streamed on and off since I was about 15, mostly on different communities when that was the big thing. The reason my channel isn't that big is because I lacked motivation or other things simply got in the way. Back to the topic though. How do you stream? How do you keep your energy level up? And what are some important things to keep in mind? I'm going to go through what I've learned over the years right now. Firstly, streaming is exhausting for anyone trying it. People might not know it or really think about it, but it is. For example, I used to only be able to stream for like 2-3 hours tops, and then I'd go to bed because of how tired I was. Now I'm able to stream for over 6 hours if it's going well. So what's my secret for streaming longer and keeping my energy level up? Actually, there are no, there's no big secret. Make sure to eat before you go live and maybe even during the stream. Get yourself some caffeine and maybe most importantly, viewers. If you're ever live and see 5 people pop in as a new streamer, you'll get some extra energy. Especially if they keep the chat going. Talking to people and being excited about them being there is a great stamina boost. And for those hours where no one is talking or if the chat is too fast, coffee or energy drinks help me out a lot. Also, when we're talking about viewers, be sure to think about your attitude. If you're being rude or overall a bad attitude towards the game, your viewers, or just in general, people won't stick around. And if they do, they're most likely going to be toxic and your community will be built on toxicity. Moving on. You will have to deal with making some difficult choices when starting out. What game do you want to play? How do you want the stream to look art-wise? Let's start with art. Art is important, but at the same time, it doesn't really matter. What I mean is, art will basically become your streaming image, but having no art wouldn't hurt that much. The real issue comes if you keep changing it up all the time, changes that people might lose interest in you if you don't have your own image, or simply lose track of you because they've gotten used to your own art. When it comes to what game you should stream, it's pretty simple. Play whatever you're good at, or whatever game you can make fun to watch. A slow stream or a stream where you die all the time instead of progressing isn't a fun stream to watch. And lastly, don't give up even if it might not go as well as you thought it would. Try to find ways to fix it, make the stream better and more interesting. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed it, I hope it helped you out. Anyways, if you want to see more, if you want to see me streaming, I stream on Mixer.com slash OxidTheGamer. And don't forget to subscribe here as well. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!